I think I may say Jean Renoir for me is the most important filmmaker of, of ever ever time. I think he's really, really a great filmmaker. He, he was very important for a, a, a part of the French cinephilia and uh, all the young critics who gathered at the Cahier du Cinéma in the 50s and who say, uh, they, they, Jacques Rivette uh, said, c'est le patron, it is the boss. Jean Renoir is a boss. He's a, he's a, he's a, guy. He's a man, he's a boss. And I, 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 I know, I can see why, because uh, um, When you see a Jean Renoir movie, it's not only a, a great movie, it's not only a masterpiece. It tells you something about, about your own life. It's, uh, in, in Jean Renoir's movie, there is something about wisdom, uh, about uh, how to be wi wise by enjoying life, but also there is something very tragic in Jean Renoir's movie. It says that, that, uh, it, it, it says that, uh, that, that life is tragic. The French cinema is will be always connected to literature, I think, uh, literature, fiction, uh, dr uh, drama, psychology, uh, and also there is a very uh, strong sense of documentarism in French cinema, you know, and that, I think that's his strength. Uh, and, well, uh, French cinema has to be itself. It, it doesn't have to imitate or to, to make thrillers or, or movies. Who cares about that? We have, uh, we, we, uh, in other countries, there are very good films like that. So uh, I think to be to be strong, uh, the French cinema has to be lit has to be um, close to literature, and also there is a kind of metaphysics in some French cinema, in some great great filmmaker like. Of course, mother was Robert Bresson, but uh, you may you may think about Jean Claude Brissot today, which I think is a is a great uh, filmmaker, or Philippe Garel, who is talking something about his own life and always with a link to what is to be romantic today. So really, always connected to the 19th century literature. Yeah, I think the French cinema is always aware that cinema is the last hour of the 19th century. The main purpose of cinema is to record reality, visible reality. I'm not a huge fan of special effect, of digital effect. I, I think it's great because we, we can experiment many things. But mainly, basically, cinema is here to record reality. And reality is the reality of the, the, the place you are, of the moment you live. So I think that's, that is the essence of cinema for me. Most of the films are made to be seen in a, la, in a theater with other people. You cannot understand an Hitchcock movie really deeply if you are not watching it in a movie and seeing how uh, the filmmaker is uh, uh, playing with your mind and playing with the mind of 500 people in, in, a, in, a, in a room. So the, this experience uh, will not stop. Totally, I think. It's always, always really important to watch a movie with, amongst other people.